the North American news, I'm Dave from PlayHerdon.com. You can go to PlayHerdon.com slash shop for all your Herdon equipment needs. We're now stocking Azuri helmets, you can find the link below. In this episode, we're taking a look at what happened in November and December of 2022. In new club news, Vancouver Wolf Tones Hurling Club was officially started this December. They're looking for new players for the 2023 season, I'll leave a link to their details below. There are now 188 clubs in North America, with 9 new clubs starting up in 2022. If you're new to Hurling or Kamoki, go to playhurling.com slash clubs to find a club near you. In Central Florida, the Orlando 7s Hurling Tournament was held on November 12th. Hurlers and Kamogues across Florida and Georgia participated, with Atlanta GA bringing home the cup. They also hosted a puck fada to finish up the tournament. Well, there's 15 of you, yeah. Yeah, and this will move 100 yards at a time. In Tennessee, two players from Nashville GAC were featured on a local podcast. They even taught the hosts how to play Hurling. You guys are with the Nashville Gaelic Athletic Club. Yep. yep. It's the fastest game in the world on grass. And the it is. fastest? Mm -hmm. It's 15 on 15. On a, oh, wow. On a field twice the size of a soccer field. Oh, so my it's, gosh. Yeah. It's huge. A lot of cardio. Yeah. That's <laughs> a lot of cardio. <laughs> yeah. In college news, the NCGA hosted a tournament for universities in the central and northeast regions. The tournament was held in Hartford, Connecticut, with the University of Pittsburgh taking a win. There are a lot of North American Harden tournaments in 2023 to look forward to. Here are some of them. Tampa Bay GA will be hosting the first tournament of 2023 for clubs and individual players. On a Friday, there will be their traditional puck around on the beach, and Saturday is the tournament day. Rock City Gaelic will host their second annual Box Harden tournament on February 4th in Rochester, New York. The Cleach GA will be hosting a fundraising over 40 tournament in Las Vegas. All proceeds will go towards funding college teams. The college national finals will be held in Louisville, Kentucky from March 25th to 26th. The best collegiate level talent from across the US will compete in this weekend championship. In Nashville, the Music City Invitational will be held at the beginning of April. Clubs from around the world will compete in the 2023 GA World Games. Derry will host from July 24th to 27th, with a day of finals in Crow Park on July 28th. The Continental Youth Championships is the largest Gaelic sports competition outside of Ireland, where over 2,500 children compete over four days. The 2023 CYC will be held in San Francisco from July 27th to 30th. This year's USGA Finals will be held in Denver, Colorado. The Midwest Tournament will be held on September 16th. Clubs from across Midwest USA will compete in Hurling, Camogie and Gaelic football. There'll be many more Hurling tournaments in 2023. If there's one you'd like to mention, leave it in the comments below. The Photos of the Month goes to the New York Minor Board for their pictures of the Christmas Camogie and Hurling Academy. They captured senior Hurling players coaching the next generation of Hurlers, which are aged under 13 to under 15. The Video of the Month goes to the Midwest GA for their promotional video for the 2023 season. Is your club interested in taking over the Play Hurling social media accounts and being featured as Club of the Month? Since 2018, we've featured dozens of Hurling clubs from across the US and Canada. Reach out if you'd like to be the next club featured. Hey, y'all. Hello, everybody in the Play Hurling community. Hey, what's up, everybody? What is up, I'm Mr. Canada. This is Jake. We're excited to join with Play Hurling. This is Benjamin Conaway. I'm the president of the Knoxville Gaelic Athletic Club. This is New York GA's takeover, so you're all very, very welcome. One, two, three, go! Here we have two new recruits, Aiden, who is a lacrosse player, and Maraid, who is a field hockey player. Both sports are really easily adapted to hurling and kamoki. Hurling has become my new favorite sport. I wish I had found it years ago. Playing curling is the greatest sport that I've ever played. It's superb exercise and it's just so much fun. And that's it for this episode of Hurling North America News. Thank you so much for watching. And if you need any hurling equipment, go to playhurling.com shop for hurls, helmets, slitters, and anything else you may need. And I'll see you guys in the next video.